Queen's Liberty of the Seas. This is day number seven. That means it's the last day of our cruise, but pretty nice looking day at sea here. So lots of fun to get into on board. Let's finish this one off right. Go ahead and get it started. Day number seven, last day on board Liberty of the Seas begins oh. right now. Dun, 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 dun. How about a special sweet treat? Ooh. It's a cupcake covered for you. Ben and Jerry's for me. Now both of these are additional cost, but I take my sweet treats seriously, so I think it's gonna be worth it. Did you know they have a giant cupcake in here that you can buy? It's $30. Wait, what? A giant cupcake. It's on the menu. A giant cupcake? Yeah, I don't see it, but it's on the menu. Hello. Hi. Hi. See? Here's the cupcake crisis, and at the bottom, giant cupcake, $29.95. Is a giant cupcake just a cake, though? Oh, good point. <laughs> Here are today's flavor options. Pistachio, chocolate, vanilla, Oreo, strawberry, and red velvet. Take it right off for you, put it on a plate. And uh, just scan your CPAS card there at the register to pay. Uh, and so those are the normal sized cupcakes, and then this to give you an idea of the mini, mini sized cupcakes. Those are $1.50 each as opposed to $2.75 for the regular. I'm not sure how big the giant cupcake is. I wonder if it comes in the box. And right at the end of the cupboard that has cupcakes, they have all these um, like little, I don't know, like photo albums, little trinkets, just kind of like souvenir type things to commemorate your cupcake adventure. Oh, look at the teapot! That's what actually came in the fun box that I pointed out earlier. Oh my the gosh! Teapot, so. <gasps> That's adorable, I love that! An important thing to remember with the cupcake um, cupboard is that they usually have a cupcake decorating class for an additional cost. It's just not functioning right now because of COVID protocols, but hopefully it'll be back very soon. So cute in there! It is, and look at that. It's got like a pink and uh, white frosting there. It's like a rose! Yeah. It every... matches me today, pink on pink. So I asked, how big is the giant cupcake? And she said... It was like about like that. It, it didn't a rough seem, estimation. It didn't seem very big. Well, I mean, big for a cupcake. Cupcakes sure, are small. Sure, yeah, but like... It... But like... It's not like the size of me. I just think <laughs> if this is like two ninety five and then the other one is ten times as much. Yeah. I think this is two fifty, so almost ten times as much or more than. It's not ten times as big, I don't think, but I don't Oh, I don't know, maybe it is. Maybe 10 times. It was, it was a rough estimate there with but the they hands. Did say you could, they did say you could get it in any flavor. Uh, so you've got your cupcake. I gotta get some ice cream. With? Jen and Barry. What flavor do you recommend? So here's a look at the menu. How much everything costs. You can get it in cup or sugar cone. You can get it on a waffle cone or you can get it made into a shape. And so just to give you an idea, here are the different cups, because they do have small, medium, large. And then the sugar cone, and the waffle cone. That one's red, I wonder if it's just dyed or if it's like a red bullet flavor. That'd be cool. Today's flavors, we have Chunky Monkey, Triple Caramel Chunk, Chip Happens, Vanilla, Chocolate, Coffee, Cherry Garcia, and Lemonade Sorbet. And here's a look at the actual items themselves. So the actual combs are all the same size. Ikea has the different sizes back there. That just means how many scoops, one, two, or three. So there is the finished product. Got the red cone. Got the large, so three scoops piled in there. They were nice enough to give me a bowl though that I could dump it in. Whoa, look at this! You're overflowing with ice cream. What'd you get? Triple caramel chunk. Since yours has a melting factor to it, I will let you do the honor, sir. That's good stuff. Oh yeah, Jen, I love ice cream. Jen Berry's got it together. 
They're running their shop well. Always. They're keeping things moo-tastic. Right. The it's the calm flavor. Here's the real question we're looking for. This is the hard-hitting knowledge we like to provide you on a daily basis. Big question. Is the cone flavored? I'm not getting anything. No? It's a facade? It's all for show? I think so. Well, I will say, it does make it look a lot prettier. Now. Oh, I don't want to ruin it. It's so pretty. It's Smash! So oh my gosh, I would be so not happy with you if you did that. Here we go. Oh, it's so hard. Uh, okay. Three, two, one. Ooh, it's thick icing. Good. Oh, that's good. That is good icing. And it doesn't taste like food coloring at all. I thought the price was really reasonable, actually. Actually. What was it, like three bucks? A little less. I think it was like two fifty or something. I would pay that for this cupcake. Well, because if you get a cupcake in like a theme park, it's going to be almost five dollars. So a lot of times, I believe, if I'm remembering correctly, I, I mean, obviously, two fifty for one cupcake is is pricey compared to just retail. But that's how it's going to be when you're traveling. The cake is good too. It's moist and everything. It's good. I'm, I'm, I'm very pleased with this. Good. Here's what I like too. Because here's, here's the main skinny with cupcakes, right? Is a proper icing to cake ratio. I like things more on the icing side because I like icing. And I'm very pleased with this. Excellent. Mm. Ooh, I just realized too as I look at my massacred cupcake. Um, I said that it matches my shirt, the pink, but also it matches the color. This little vanilla rosette cupcake was just was just meant to be for today. Hop back in the room really quick to grab some gear for our live stream that will be happening momentarily. Oh, I thought you were just saying loser. You were saying live stream. I get it now. But, ba -da -ba. <laughs> but an interesting item, we got this paper on our door telling us that um, we need to return our pool towels by 8 p.m. tonight in order to not get charged for them. We've never gotten this before, but yet again, we don't grab pool towels too terribly often and keep them overnight. So just FYI, turning your pool towels before 8 p.m. on the last day. Oh yeah, we get this uh, letter on boarding day about our crown and acre because we're diamond status and all the things that we can get on board. And we noticed this one free day of surf internet for one device or $25.99 off any internet package. I was just curious, like, how you obtain that and you just tried it and apparently it's really easy. So pretty much all you do, like, whenever you want to access internet or pur purchase a package in general, you hit access internet. Um, if you don't, if you just want to use the Royal Caribbean app for free, you can do so by clicking that. But um, for this, you would access internet. And then for the first time you do it, you would just put in your name and all your information, create a pin, accept the privacy and policy, hit next. And then it'll bring up a, um, a screen where it automatically has a coupon um, that is associated with you and your stateroom number that will give you a day for free. So I think it said that like one day would be $24.99 and then it just automatically subtracted it and had like a total of zero. And then you can just click it like, yes, I want to use it today. So now when you sign in, it'll automatically have your surf plan available to you for that day. And it will tell you how much longer you have that free day of internet available to you. Now it is with the, um, the surf. So that will give you like Instagram, email, like web pages, that kind of stuff. Um, it's not the streaming part of it, so you won't be able to like watch movies or videos so much, but you will be able to access internet and free for a day. So that was a really nice perk. Whoa, there's like a little, I don't know if it's a typhoon, but kind of like that. It's just a little, it's like it's trying to make a little swirly. Yeah. The water a little bit. It's definitely swirling around out there. Oh yeah, 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 look, 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 look. Whoa! No way! Oh, lightning strike over there. I've never seen this on a sea before. Yeah, we're really close to it too. This kind of 
Oh. Yikes. Lightning and the thunder. <laughs> Aha. No $25 per towel charge for us. Let's continue our sweet theme of the day. At? Sprinkles! Uh, included ice cream. Uh, this ben and one, Jerry's is extra. This one's free. What flavor do you want? Vanilla. Vanilla. So typically on a Royal Caribbean ship, they'll have vanilla, they'll have chocolate, you can do the swirl. Sometimes you can get strawberry if you're lucky. Sweet treats are made of these. Let the rain fall down. <laughs> it is coming. We are going right through a storm. We started this cruise with interesting weather and by golly, we're going to end this cruise with interesting weather. Holy cow. It's coming down. that we were going to give you updates if the Jumbotron just wasn't working that day or if it was just out because of wind or whatever. It's been out the entire cruise, so. Uh, the Jumbotron outside is not currently functional. Now I mentioned earlier that I got the free day of surf internet we also, on our own for the whole week, purchased a surf and stream package to share because we do things like live streams and such like that while we're on board. Why don't you tell us how has the internet been on board? Because we get a lot of questions about that often. Yeah, it's, it's been, I would say overall, it's been really good. So the only problem with it has been that randomly it will disconnect. It's like the Wi-Fi just goes away, but then it comes right back. And the good news is you don't have to re-log in most of the time. It keeps you logged in. It's just like, I don't know, the Wi-Fi goes away and then it comes right back. And that hasn't been, it doesn't always do that, just occasionally. But when it's connected and when it's running, I think it's been really good. Cherry. Olive. I don't know what that is. <laughs> we just popped into the dining, dining lounge to show the evening hors d'oeuvre, so to speak. I didn't realize there was a TV in here. That's really cool. I didn't notice that. You see the sign here. We are getting ready for you. Allow us to serve you. We'll be ready at 5 o'clock. So they have some different stuff in here each night. Like right now they have some cheese stuffed meatballs, hot dogs, vegetable spring rolls, chicken saute and they have different sauces. Sweet chili sauce, barbecue sauce, hot sauce, honey mustard sauce. They have some different kinds of breads, crazy brochettes, shrimp cocktail, assorted sweets, looks like little brownies and things, assorted cold cuts and cheeses. So you come in here in the diamond lounge if you have access and uh, take in the food if you like. You hear that? <laughs> Sounds like my daughter Patty's found that old exercise oh, no. machine from the attic. <laughs> it does sound like that. That's Carousel Progress if you don't know that reference. All that to say, we, we wanted to make note of that because the elevators have been like really, um, how would you word it? Inconsistent. Inconsistent, the sailing. So like sometimes like they shake while you're in it um, and sometimes but on the other day we had one like we were going up going up and then all of a sudden it just started slowly going down it, all the way to deck one it stopped like halfway between 12 and 13 so we could see like through the door yeah because we were in a glass one uh -huh. and we could see through the door between the two floors and then yeah it just slowly like went all the way down yeah to one. like you know how in die hard where like he has it like in between the floors yeah. and he like puts the screwdriver in to hold it open. It wasn't open, but it was like that, like in between the floors. So. Welcome to the party, pal. <laughs> yeah. I feel like Wonder Woman. <laughs> there is one thing and only one thing only that we have not done on this cruise yet. What's that? That might be a lie, but <laughs> Challengers Video Arcade. All I can say is unless we're planning on doing this job in <laughs> Reno, then we're in Bonnie. Bonnie, Bonnie Rubble. Rubble. Trouble! There's quite a history with this game. 
We're using your C Pass card. That was on Independence of the Seas too. But I lost my C Pass card in the or your C Pass card. Yeah, you didn't use yours, you lost mine. The on slot. the last day. On the last day. So, Laughing Madness, do you want to be the Joker or Batman? I just want to be the person who gets to keep their C Pass card. Probably be Batman then. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. Mr. J. It looks like you're the big winner though. Oh, 10,000 on the oh, first shot. 10,000 on the first shot. I'm not going for a duck, I'm gonna pluck a duck. Okay. Time to pluck a duck. And apparently have a hoedown. I really want one of these ones that look like a peacock. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 you got a good oh, wave oh, there. Oh, oh, so oh. close. You got it. Good to go. 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 This arcade is it digitally tracks your tickets so you can visit the prize hub. That ah. should stop. And the little pod should come out. Yep, there we go. And it'll turn and that will release the prize into the chute. Oh, it's big! And you got a little your I don't prize know. Is ready. Some kind of little keychain. Cool. Does it light up? Whoa. Oh, it does! Oh, it changes colors! I love it! It's actually pretty cool for such a small prize. Just outside the arcade, we find ourselves back at Johnny Rockets. Now, as much as we might be tempted to, we're not eating dinner here tonight, but we do have our BOGO 50 on milkshakes. It's sweet treat day, and you can't have sweet treat day without getting a Johnny Rockets milkshake. Two milkshakes to go, but wait, there's more. Look how cute! That's so fun. That's such a cool way to do it to go. I heart you too, Johnny Rocket. <laughs> so how the um, billing ended up working is that they took 50% off of both of them. So I guess that's kind of like technically buy one, get one free, but the way they did it was just to take 50% off of both of them. So yeah. just FYI. 50% off and at one time per cruise. But you know what? what's not 50% off? My love for you. <laughs> Whoa, Friday Night Knicks, but actually Saturday Night Knicks, but that's not how the song goes. Friday Night Knicks. I never gotten to see the Knicks play on the on the cruise ship. And we got our milkshakes to go because tonight's dinner is room service. We haven't done it yet. On this ship at least. Here's a look at the room service. I think they call this like the all day menu. They do have breakfast as well at a different hour. And so as you can see here, a fee of $7.95 per room delivery. So not per item, you can order as much as you want, $7.95 and they'll add an 18% gratuity automatically to that, which I appreciate because you typically don't have cash so it just makes things easier. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, 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 eating in tonight, Ooh, yeah. eating in tonight, oh yeah, 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 yeah. eating in tonight, not on a diet. Oh, definitely not. We got the burger and fries, we got the grilled cheese, which I didn't know come with fries, there's more fries there. Chicken tenders, which also didn't know those came with fries, and I say that because then we ordered sides of fries. Yeah. Lots of fries. We're going home tomorrow, and we're driving back to Florida tomorrow, so it starting a long drive so we wanted to make sure we got to bed early so we ordered the food we packed up while we were waiting on the food it took like a, what about like 40 minutes but i like the situation that that kind of 
And that, that might be a thing we do now on the last night because it kind of makes it convenient for like packing and getting in so then you're rested for the next day because you have to get up early so yeah about 10 bucks with the tip we'll That's take worth that it to me yeah <laughs> Also, we ordered a pizza with our room service. Um, we didn't show that because they didn't bring it. Or we were just kind of like going to let it lie. Yeah. Uh, but then they just called and said, did you receive a pizza? No, we did not receive a pizza. Now they're going to bring it. I guess they had a pizza sitting there with no home. And they say, hey, who does this pizza belong to? It must be the Hoffmans because they love pizza. And they were right. They are right. So <laughs> we're going to tuck in here, enjoy our room service food. And we hope you have enjoyed today's video and the entire Liberty of the Seas playlist because this is drawing it to a close. I know. It was our first sailing of the whole year of 2022. Ooh. We'll leave you with this as we always do. If you're interested in coming on board Liberty of the Seas or another Royal Caribbean vessel, of course we can help make that happen as travel agents. It'd be our pleasure. It's completely free to you. You don't pay anything extra. Blah, 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 blah. Travel agent information. It's in the description of the video. HoffmanHappyTravels.com is the website. You can reach us there as well. So once again, I want to thank you for joining us for the Liberty of the Seas playlist. But we're signing off. It's on to the next one. We'll see you next time. Happy, Happy travels! One more time. Liberty, 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 Liberty. liberty. liberty.